Okay, everyone. Sorry about the other uh, video. Apparent it, the video is fine. It's just, I guess, when you turn your phone at a certain angle, it uh, rotates it when it publishes it on YouTube. So, for those who have a hard time uh, following along with the uh, with the video and trying to uh, see everything, I thought I'd just do a, a really quick run through. Uh, hopefully this one will uh, show it <laughs> correctly. Hey, live and learn, right? So anyway, here's that uh, mini I made for my sister uh, using scraps. And uh, the tutorial for this would be uh, from uh, Angel Wings 14100. She does an awesome tutorial. She actually has a video of the completed album and then she has uh, a tutorial on how to put it all together because it is made completely from scraps from cardstock and whatever scraps you have which is a great way to use them up so anyway um, I use the graphic 45 bird song um, as I stated before and uh, I'm just going to go through this really quick so maybe you can uh, see it a little better. So here's the front cover and it opens up and uh, move this over because the light through the window is, is so bad. Uh, here's the uh, front inside cover and uh, I have uh, tags uh, backed by cardstock. Um, like I said before, uh, some of them have uh, journaling lines. And uh, uh, you can still write on the back or put another photo. Um, I did that uh, for my sister who is a non-scrapper. She does like to write, so I'm making sure I include a pen, uh, a white gel pen that writes nicely on the back of uh, black. Um, use the Fisker on the Edge punch uh, to make my pockets on most of them. Here's the other side of the front cover. Um, I used uh, Prima Flowers, some cutouts backed by the cardstock. Uh, like I said before, I'm not sure what I'm going to do here of anything. Still thinking about it, but once I do it, this is going to be off in the mail. And really probably won't have time to do a video uh, on it. So that's why I'm doing this now. So you open up the cover. Another pocket. Um, some more tags, um, all from the collection. They're so cute. And then a photo mat. Some of them are backed with other paper, some aren't. Um, and then you can put another photo here, another large photo here, or a couple of small ones. Opens up, have another pocket here, a uh, tag. This one's two-sided. Um, and then you can put a photo here if she wants. And this is this is actually the back side to this uh, paper. So obviously matches very well. Uh, then you come over to here back to the center. And you have uh, several um, smaller ones. So another six small photos can go there. Another large one. Open it up. Another pocket. A few more uh, tags. Uh, this pocket um, used recollections. Uh, uh, it's a glitter uh, butterfly tape. Um, and then we have two larger ones. So another four photos. Another large photo can go here. Open it up. Another pocket. Use Recollections Bling out of a dollar fifty bin. A couple of more uh, tags, and then this is the center, and uh, it's plain cardstock with uh, the on the edge punch by Fiskers again. These were some cutouts that I backed with uh, black cardstock just to give it some dimension. Um, didn't really want to put something totally here, but it gave it something to, to uh, separate pages. 
and uh, another tag and two smaller ones again where you can uh, write on them and then uh, another large photo mat and again she can put uh, a photo here so I know I'm running through this quick but of course I already went over most of this on the uh, other video so um, unfortunately it's just turned at an angle so just in case you have a hard time seeing it I wanted to go back over it again um, and let you see uh, what it uh, looked like uh, straight on um, like I said, uh, this is for my sister who's a non-scrapper, so I kept the embellishments very, very light. Um, but this was a very easy album to make, and you should check out, um, uh, Angel Wings, uh, 14100, her tutorial. Uh, she does an awesome job. Plenty of room for extra photos in this album. So... Anyway, thank you for watching, and I apologize for the previous uh, uh, video, and hey, live and learn. I guess I won't turn my phone at an angle the next time, so it won't happen. Thanks for watching again. Bye-bye.